Dear brothers and sisters in Christ in Iowa, God still has work for us to do in this world. The tragic events in Charlottesville, Virginia last weekend demonstrate clearly that now more than ever, people of faith must take a clear stand against racism in every form. We do that because we are followers of Jesus, the one who spoke out against violence, oppression, hatred, and prejudice wherever it presented itself. The challenge is that racial bias is embedded in our culture in the United States and can be very subtle. We often do not even see how these attitudes influence us. At this important moment in time, I am encouraging all United Methodists in Iowa, including myself, to do four things. First, look deep into your heart as you consider your own attitudes toward race. How do you think, talk, and act in ways that might denigrate those of a different race, culture, or country? If you are white, how might that give you advantages that others do not have? What is it that prevents you from seeing everyone in our world as a precious child of God and a person of sacred worth? Second, Consider ways in which your local church can live out our aspiration to be disciples of Jesus Christ with open minds, open hearts, and open doors. Imagine your church from the perspective of someone from another race, culture, language, or country. How welcoming are you? Can you look at your community with new eyes, seeking out the voices that are missing, empowering those who are marginalized, and speaking out on behalf of justice and mercy. Third, make a commitment to build bridges of understanding. Teach and model inclusivity to your children. Intentionally seek out those of a different race or country and engage in dialogue. Form a sister church relationship with a congregation that has a different culture or language than yours. Check out umc.org backslash embrace love, which includes many worship and study resources from across the connection. Finally, I encourage you to remember John Wesley's three simple rules for United Methodists. Do no harm, do good, and stay in love with God. May God bless each one of you as you make a positive difference in your local community, our country, and our world.